as you can see i just got my hair done um it's not as dramatic as i thought honestly but it's fine because i can change it every time that's the great thing about extensions and it's Cinco de Mayo i want to go get some mexican food i'm gonna be honest but i'm about to see i'm gonna go home first and I just hit my friend and I was like, let's get Mexican food. But I wanted to show y'all my hair. I'm gonna show you guys a better view. And also once my makeup and all, ooh, the lighting is way better in here. Um, it's hot. I don't know if it's hot because my car was just in the sun or what. But yeah, that's what we're looking like. <laughs> I hate when people do that face, but so cute. It's my vacation here. Very subtle still, but you know, just enough. Ooh, I like this. Okay, all right. I don't know why I'm even feeling myself because my lashes and my makeup needs to be done. But yeah, that was a little sneaky peeky. See y'all when I do something else. So, this video is just my maintenance kind of appointments for vacation. So my hair, my nails, I'm getting brows done tomorrow. Um, what else? I'm getting laser done. Like all my pre-vacation -vac maintenance appointments. So hair is done now. And today I think that's all I'm gonna do. I was gonna go to a consultation for something that I wanna get, but I decided not to do it because honestly, I just didn't have the time. And I was gonna squeeze it in my day, but it just wasn't necessary, it wasn't mandatory. So we're gonna finish everything else tomorrow. And then I go to vacation on Wednesday. Today is, today's Friday? Today's Friday. So I'm excited. I've always wanted to do like a maintenance vlog just of all my routines and all of my appointments to prep. Cause you know, those couple of days before vacation is like an Olympics. You gotta get everything just done. Oh, and I'm getting my lashes. Um the day before I leave so all all of that will be in here but these are my lashes now they came out a lot I think just because I've been getting them more natural so they don't last as long but um yeah we need these fixed I had to stop and record stop from listening to my music and record because y'all I'm on the scariest hill ever like I just went up like that and I'm now stuck on the hill there's traffic and I'm just like this is scary what the f what the freak this is scary i'm gonna show y'all but it's like something that i can't really show you just have to be here let me see if you guys could tell how like high up i am in my car right now hold on so you can't tell but i'm like literally on a slope like that and nothing's moving it's like the traffic goes all the way down um this is the car behind me this is scary though like if I don't know. I'm, I'm a little nervous. I gotta just be careful. It doesn't look like it's crazy though, but it feels like it, you know? You can kind of see it a little better now, but like this is the traffic that I'm in all the way up here. This is so weird. I have not been on a slope hill, whatever, this long. I mean, this high, like this is crazy. Like I'm going all the way down there. This is crazy. All right, so it's the next day. It's so loud in my garage. I hope y'all can hear me. I don't know if you can hear me, but I'm dressed and about to head to my brow appointment. I have not gotten my eyebrows done in months, y'all, because I went to a new person one time just because I wanted to switch from laughing to dreading and she thinned out my eyebrows and I just didn't do it for like seven months. So I'm going back to my original girl today. I'm excited because I've been growing them out so they're gonna be nice and fresh and yeah, um, about to head there. Running a little bit behind, but not as late as, as I could be. So, um, I'm gonna try my best to record a little bit of her doing my brows, but I don't really know if I'll be able to. Just because I have to like hold my eyebrows when I get them done, it's a little different than like anything else. All right, I'm on the freeway. I just told her I'm running like 10 behind, and yeah, I'm going to get my brows done. So I'm gonna show y'all before. God, traffic is just the cause of everything. If there was no traffic, I'd feel time everywhere. Um, okay, well, these are my brows right now. You can see they're just really grown out. My lashes, I know, they're terrible, but I'm getting those done either tomorrow or the day before I leave. 
she's trying to see if she can fit me in um at tomorrow because i oh my bad um because i told her that i'm just picking my lashes and i can't wait so we're gonna see if she can fit me in but yeah brows done today and then what else because my whole week is beauty stuff oh then after brows i have my laser appointment just for my arms because they messed up and like canceled my appointment yesterday well told me it was canceled and then it wasn't really canceled so yesterday i was supposed to get arms and legs i ended up just getting i just ended up not not making it because i thought it was canceled and rescheduled and it turns out the reschedule wasn't even scheduled so now i had to just fit myself in based on their availability and they only had today um for arms but not arms and legs so i'm gonna try to do my legs before i leave but arms are more important because i grow more hair there for some reason like my hair is still growing there legs they don't grow that much um so i'll try to record a little bit of that it's gonna be quick and then after arms after my laser i have a nail appointment so yeah that's my day and then lashes in a few days <laughs> just left i'm very red because i haven't gotten and it looks like i'm breaking out but it's not it's just the redness because i haven't gotten my brows waxed in months like in so long my she's like your skin is so sensitive you have baby skin and she's like i'm trying to be very careful but um yeah those look good when the redness goes down when i have on makeup i don't fill in my brows and i think next time i told her i want to get them laminated Cause I just like the look of them being brushed out and yeah, they kind of look laminated now, but they're not. These are just my brows cleaned up. So once the redness goes down, I think, uh, I don't know if she put anything on it, but I want to put like witch hazel or something, but I don't have nothing on me. Um, I'm about to head to my laser, but I have like an hour before the appointment. So I think I'm going to get Starbucks, but then there's a Starbucks next to the spot. So I don't know. I'm about to figure out. I'm about to look at my little map, see how far everything is, and figure out what I'm going to do. So as you just saw, I just got laser on my arms. I'm gonna come back for legs on Monday because they just don't have appointments with the same thing. They're so booked. Um, and I wanted to show y'all my little Starbucks order. I'm sure I've mentioned it before, but it hasn't changed. I get the grande. I don't know why I'm reading this as if I shouldn't just remember, right? Um, I got a grande and I just got the iced oat milk brown sugar latte iced latte with vanilla cold foam so it's basically it says blonde espresso so just the blonde espresso with vanilla sweet cold foam on top and oat milk and that's like my usual order i've been starting to drink it from here because i always use a straw just because i don't like my teeth are like i said a little yellow and i don't like them looking stained but if you get cold foam you got to drink it that way or else you're surpassing the cold foam so i try to drink a little bit like that and just finish with the straw um, and yeah, I was trying to record a tiny bit of my arms, but we were talking and it was like, I was trying not to be rude. Um, I'm getting used to these little peekaboo highlights. They're just so subtle. Um, but I wanted to show you guys, I get bumps. So if you get laser and you get these bumps, it's not like, don't be alarmed. It's normal. I always get bumps on my arms and they go away like before the day is over. Um, so... If you could see on camera, I have glasses on, so I don't know what y'all can see. Do you see the bumps a little bit? They're already going down, but my hand has them more. Ooh, see, it looks, it looks a little scary, but I've gotten laser a million times and it's always fine. So do not be alarmed. 
when you get bumps that means it's working that means it really is killing those hair follicles so but yeah i only really get them there i don't get them on other areas but if you get them on other areas it's fine as well and once i got it on my face but it wasn't those bumps it was like it made me break out because i do laser my face but it was only one time that i broke out from it and i think i just didn't go in with a very clean face and you have to make sure your pores are closed so um even if you shower before coming rinse with cold water like you want to close up your pores so you just have the most seamless experience my next appointment is at 3 30 so it's so funny i'm just such a typical girl like all these little appointments i haven't ate all day but this coffee i have my bag of vitamins here because i wanted to wait till i ate it's only three um before taking them but i don't think i'm gonna eat before then coffee is really like my my meal but my nail appointment is my last appointment today 3 30 um then i'm gonna go home and just relax i need to do some laundry and kind of just start packing so i'll probably just do that chill relax whatever and i just told my friend to come over for pictures before we go to dinner we're going to dinner tonight i'm probably not going to vlog that but we're going to take pictures before we go so yeah but this vlog is my maintenance vlog which i've never done and it's because all my maintenance appointments are usually spread out but before trips i do like a little maintenance olympics but i'll see y'all at my nails so bye <laughs>
I didn't really even think about picking up my camera. I was tired and I, I just got that and left and came straight home and I just ordered some food. I'm about to edit some previous videos because I want to start posting my YouTube stuff and I'm going to edit this one. Um, but yeah, I just want to let you guys know. I just got my lashes done so you could see how it looked the other day. And what else do I have left? Tomorrow, I have another laser appointment. Um, and then I think that's all my maintenance. <laughs> My brows, my lashes, my laser, um, pretty much it. My pedicure had been done if you really want to see my feet, but yeah, I'm sleepy right now, so but I'm not going to go to sleep. I'm going to continue being productive, and I'm trying to debate on if I want to wash my hair because I'm just not feeling it straight. Like, I just don't like my hair straight. And it was going to be curly for my trip regardless, but I'm like, maybe I should wash it while I'm still home just so I could see how I like it. I feel like it's just, it needs some curls, but like curly curls. So I think I'm going to wash my hair today. Something that normally would have also been a part of my maintenance is um, spray tans or just self tan, but I want to get a real tan when I'm out there. And I bought this to do so, so. It's the Maui Bay Browning Lotion, and I, I hear good things about this. So I'm going to put this on and get a real with a freaking tan. Hopefully, my face gets a tan as well, but I don't like tanning my face just because I have a lot of, like, discoloration, and I don't want that to get worse. Um, and it is Sunday, so I think a little later, I'm going to just do some, like, face stuff. I'm, like, my exfoliating days, masks. So I don't do it often. Um, and another thing, if you didn't know... If you're about to go on a trip or on a plane, do not do a face mask before the plane. Like, don't do one right before you go or in the morning or whatever because it opens up your pores. And you don't want your pores open on a flight. That's how you're going to break out. And it's already like the air and stuff is congested. So you just want your pores to be closed and you want your skin to be moisturized. And that is the way to go on a flight. Do all of your maintenance a week before. And that way, if anything goes wrong, you also have like a week to to prepare before your trip. 